up everybody this is your girl ej and really quickly because it's a saturday we got games to go we got cars to watch we we we, we got stuff to do mary j blige done a recent interview where she said she she not studying no kids <laughs> she don't want no kids she said she would rather look for a lash tech than a babysitter rather spend her money on gucci and fendi and herself not child care she is probably giving kiki wyatt the biggest side eye. I'm sure she's not, Mary J. Blige is not like that. Do you know Mary J. Blige personally? No, I'm saying she's probably not like that. Mary J. Blige is super grown and what works for you is what works for you and what works for me is what works for me. That was me speaking for Mary J. Blige. Anyway, she said she don't have time to be, you know, keeping up with kids. She wanna just worry about herself. She don't wanna have to worry about other people. Cause when you have kids, you worry about other people. And she's been very vocal about a lot of stuff. She told y'all, quit calling her auntie. She don't like it. Now she's saying she don't want no kids, so you ain't never got to worry about a little bit of short people walking beside her. You ain't never got to worry about her pushing no stroller. It's not gonna happen. And honestly, I'm glad she said this because a lot of people um, tie femininity and womanhood to motherhood. And a lot of people act like womanhood and motherhood have to coexist like in the same ball. It don't. Just because you're a woman, doesn't mean you want to have kids. And that don't mean something is wrong with you. It don't mean you've been traumatized. Babe, sometimes you just don't want the cheering. You just, you you just, you just don't. You, hey, you don't, you don't want the cheering. Sometimes you want to go to bed, you don't want to wake up fixing bottles. Sometimes you want to buy your snacks and you eat all of them by yourself. Sometimes you don't want to clean fingerprints off your car window. You got to constantly vacuum snacks and Skittles and M&Ms up off the back floor. Everybody don't want that. Now, like I said, I appreciate her for actually saying it because you do have powerful women like her, uh, Oprah, uh, Ava DuVernay, you know, these powerful women um, do not have children and that's okay. Now, if you want to stretch your womb out 10 them times, you know, like Kiki White and EJ, Okay, do that. But if you don't, sweetie, don't. And you don't let nobody make you feel bad about that. I think motherhood and parenthood should be, um, you know, a choice that we own like anything else. You know, if we don't want to eat meat, we don't have to eat meat. If we don't want to eat uh, veggies. Of course, if you're not eating veggies, you know, I, I can only imagine, you know, how, how, how hard that is on your body and your bowel movements. The point is, it's your choice. And like I said, I'm just glad Mary J. Blige actually said it because a lot of times people just don't have children and no one asks the question. They just assume whatever they assume. But Mary J. Blige said, I, 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 forget them kids. Forget them kids.